Hello guys, it's me Cameron and we're in a completely different room now. Yeah. I was like, changing position was good. But just changing the bloody room would be perfect. No. no I had to change room because my mum's sleeping upstairs so I can't use my room to record in. Also my dad's working on the attic so there's a lot of banging. And so this makes it the quietest place to actually record in. Yay. So this video is going to have three parts, it's going to be a complaint to start with, a little bit of good news, and then the actual solid chunk of the video. So that's how it's going. The complaint is about my exam, the good thing is about college, and the third thing is about the general election. So the complaint is uh, about my exam. Now the exam was fine, you know, the, all that. But it's what happened before the exam. Right. I woke up at 8 this morning ish. I came downstairs about 8 ish. And I was like, yeah, I can do this. It's all good. Mom's like, oh, when's your exam? I was like, it's at 9 o'clock. She like, oh, okay. She went, oh, what time will you be finished by? I'm like, I don't know. I'll just check my phone. I checked my phone. My exam wasn't at 9 o'clock, it was at flopping 1 o'clock. So I got up for like absolutely no reason. So yeah, that's annoying me. Um so that's the that's the complaining. Done. Now the good news is I uh, I got into college. Yeah, you know, yesterday I got a letter through the door saying that I'd get given an unconditional Yeah, an unconditional to get in. Which pretty much means that I'm in. So it's all good. So yeah, start that in September. The the funny thing was, I was actually about to apply for a job, and they said, "Are oh, you at college?" I was like, "Oh no, I haven't got in." And then I got this letter through, so I st I still went for that job. Yeah, it was good. So the third point is about the general election. The general election, for people that don't know what it is, is how we decide our prime minister who's going to be taking over. It's a bit like, well, no, it's not a bit like it is, like, uh, election day for America when they choose the president. Well, that's pretty much what this is like. The, yeah, so, it's cool. And, um, this year, we have now got a full conservative party government, yes, <laughs> we finally got it out. Which is going to be run by um, Mr. David Cameron, uh, which I'm not too happy by because every time we have a Conservative government, something seems to go wrong. Mostly for Scotland, if I, if I remember rightly. Margaret, Fa Margaret Thatcher. Yeah. A lot of the. T Margaret Thatcher, a lot of the taxes were tested on Scot before the rest of the UK. Tony Blair, Tony Blair was kind of for the whole UK. Um, he got us dragged into the war in Iraq, even though the, Sc the Scottish, M the Scottish, Irish, and the Welsh uh, MPs said no because they weren't majority, and because Tony Blair had majority there, he pretty much got pushed through. I say that, I think it might have just been the Scots that said no, or voted no against it. Which, you know, in the long run, we probably shouldn't have went in. And uh, Gordon Brown, I think he was Conservative. If I got this wrong, can you please say, oh, you got it wrong as such with this person. Um, well, just, it's, it's Gordon Brown. <laughs> You know, I can't actually state exactly what happened in his rule, but I know <laughs> I was like a dictator under his government, but something did, but something did go wrong. I know that. But, yeah. Actually, more things went wrong with Margaret, Margaret Thatcher because that was during the uh, miners' strike where. Um, the where Labour actually got a massive um, boost, if I remember. Yeah, I think Labour got quite a good 
um, like publicity off the back of that because uh, they were actually all about the people. They were all about working class. They were for trade, trade unions. So they were, they're not so much now. They've kind of lost their roots. Which is why I think they actually lost the election this year. And last year. I think if they came back to their roots, they would have been cool. But yeah, so they got a nice little think off of manufacturers. Failings, I guess. She was also our first female Prime Minister. But she was white. Which is probably something we need to fix. Not her being white, but she's, she's dead now. Got wait. Mm -hmm. You know, that's a song that like, is going to be ill and then. But we still we need to get, like, full of America. Get, like, a black Prime Minister in. We do have a black um, lady, though. As in, in the House of Lords, we have a black lady. As in, like, Lord and Lady, not just, oh, it's just a man lady. Yeah, that's <laughs> just like Which is, like, a big one for because she's not only black, but she was also a female. So it's pretty good. So, yeah. But that's really, that. that's, you know, Conservatives won. Good on them. It, it looked like they weren't going to, because they had, they barely won the majority, I say this because majority you need twenty uh three hundred and twenty six seats. I think they actually end up getting three hundred and twenty nine. I think I didn't actually. I stopped watching after they got majority because you know, not much else was going to change. <laughs> but I think they got that, so it means they actually only got three more seats than they actually need than they needed for majority. And if four of those seats had gone to like Labour. Lib Dems, NS, NSA, well, SNP, yeah, SNP, yeah, SNP, oh, that's in isn't it? Then they wouldn't have got majority, and they would have had to have another co coalition. Probably with Lib Dems again, but still, on Brighton News, on my part, the NS. SNP, yeah, SNP, yeah, SN, Scottish Nationalist Party, um, won um, like a landslide amount of seats up in Scotland. They only lost three seats, and that was to Lib Dems up in the Orkney Islands. Yes, I'm trying to remember my islands. Yeah, um, Labour in Edinburgh West and Dumfries. For Conservatives, so but the rest of Scotland it was fifty six seats. Yeah, fifty six seats went to them. This is good, which means that there's going to be a lot of change in the House of Parliament because, like the House of Commons and worse. Actually, it's probably just going to be the House of Commons. Think about it. Yeah, because the they were planning on putting through a bill where Scottish MPs could only develop stuff on Scottish issues, English on English, Irish on Irish, and Welsh on Welsh. However, you take out the Scottish, take out the Welsh, and take out the Irish. Now, the Welsh and the Irish ain't going to do too much because I think they're about 1% of the overall seats. Oh, no, actually, think about it, yeah, not, not only, actually, because, well, obviously there's Irish Conservative, Lib Dem, and Labour, but, which means that there's going to be, like, 60 taken away from Scotland, and a lot of that 60 is going to be in the, on the Nationalists, which is not really what the government want. Because obviously the Nationalist Party was the one that wanted to push for the referendum. If it had been Labour and Conservative, then I think they'd have been cooler with saying, "Oh yeah, you go do do with your own stuff." Because it's Nationalist, they may change their tune on that. Because oh, 
I'm not sure if you guys can hear that. My dog is snoring. Lucy. Yeah. Wait, I'll go I'll go show you Lucy. And if you thought if you've seen me on Vine you'll know her. Yeah. So yeah, the government may need to change their plans. Well, sorry, I'm trying to hold this. Perfect. Yeah, so they may be needing to change their plans because the nationalists are coming in. So this was a hell of longer than I was actually going to do the video. But anyway, I've been me, you've been you. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a like, a nice big thumbs up. Uh, share it if you think other people would enjoy this. If you haven't already, then please subscribe, because that would be brilliant, because it shows me that you guys are enjoying it, and you guys get to see the videos as soon as I release them. So I will be back tomorrow with another video. Goodbye.